Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Toxic Health. I'm here today to look into musical cards and we're going to look into the EMI that comes out of these cards. And this is just a card I picked up while I was on my travels and I got curious as to how much EMI it would give out. And here when you open it, it plays a tune. So, to detect this EMI, we're going to use a standard AM radio. This is tuned into 530 on the AM band. And you can be tuned into anywhere on the AM band as long as there's no radio station there. So we're tuned into static. Um, we've chosen 530 because it's the quietest place on the AM band. So I'm going to turn on the radio and we can start scanning this card. So you can see while it's not playing a tune, it has no effect on the radio. But all that changes when we open it. As you can see, it's putting out quite a field. And uh, I was quite surprised at how much of a field is coming out of it, with it being a card. I really didn't expect it to produce much of a field. But it actually produces about a six inch field. So it's something to be aware of. A lot of these electronic devices are actually producing radio wave fields. And this is an issue because extended exposure to radio wave fields may make you ill. And almost everything that is electrical and electronic does it. So it pays to know the fields that are around the equipment that you own and what you come into contact with. And uh, act accordingly. You, you don't want to spend extended time in electromagnetic interference fields because it is a stimulant to the human body. I hope you enjoyed this presentation and I wish you the best of health. Thank you.